Welcome back to the city of Atlantis in City Skylines. So, I have some bold plans today. Well, not so bold, but that would be quite nice to do something like this. Uh, the reason why we are looking the city from this uh, point of view here is because of this island. There we go. So, the reason why this island became kind of important for us right now is that, well, we are kind of running out of space, at least in the tiles that we have unlocked. And this is one of the few places here where we can expand a lot. And I don't want to do that. <laughs> so yeah, it doesn't make any sense to tell you something like this, but bear with me, it does. Um, if we look at the... Let me open the this tab here the education overlay, as we can see, we have everyone educated in this area. And by the way, they are complaining that we don't have enough educated workers. So, and we don't have demand for residential, if you look at that. Uh, high school, it's highly educated as well. We do have a few people in here and there and i believe this is mainly because this was the last area that we built and this one is probably they didn't have time yet to go to get educated or they are actually too far away from the high school we if we add a high school here then that problem will be fixed but this one we do have a high school in here and we have like a pretty good capacity and a lot of students in there and they will get educated very soon. But we don't have a university. So as you can see, we do have some educated people, but these uh, are usually people that get educated outside of the city. And we have almost 7,000 people eligible for university. And we don't have a university. So we could go ahead and just select one of these universities in here, but I do want to get a university campus. Our options are the trade school campus, the liberal arts college, the uh, varsity, well, varsity sports is not an option actually, <laughs> and the university campus. But for this one, we need 24,000 people in the city. So definitely not going for this. Last time on our last city, we went with the trade school, which looked quite nice, but I think we can go with the liberal arts college. Let's get a uh, campus area in here. I will get the whole island and I will do this as good as possible. And then I'll be back when I finish doing this. And here we go, we do have our nice little campus area in here. Still don't have a name for that university, but we will get there. Um, now going back to the university area in here, and now we can add the Liberal Arts Administration building. But of course, before we even do that, we need a way to actually get into the university. I don't think I want anything too crazy, like I would love to do these roads that we have here, but they seem quite busy and I don't think they fit with the area. I still want to do something with bikes and I think the only options that we have would be smaller roads. Let me see, I could get some trans in there as well and actually use these main roads uh, as train networks. But I don't think I'll do that right now. What I'll do, I'll get one of those simpler roads in here, not the asymmetrical one, this one, and probably go from here. Yeah, I'm just concerned about the ferries that we have, and I do want to add another stop there. But I think this is the higher point for us to cross. 
and let's do it. So from here, we need to actually create our, um, our network, or at least the main entrance to the university area. I think we will have like some parking at the front and that's, that's it really. Uh, I don't want to have too much here at the front. Everything else will be pathways and all that sort of stuff. So coming through here, I don't know if I would do this, but let's set this like so. And then we will look at what we, we do here. The main building, I think we could add it right here. So when you're, yay, everyone's happy. Look at that, the whole city, so many smiley faces. So we now have this and I can I go closer? Yes, I can. So there we go. Oh, this looks quite good. When you arrive, you have the waterfall at the back. You have this great building around here. You still have the bike pathway on your uh, side here so people can easily use that. And there we go. Oh, quite, quite happy about this building here. So getting out of this view, I think the next step would probably see what type of buildings we have here. We have some dormitories, we have the liberal arts study hall, we have the groundskeeping, and we have the drama club. So what's the size of this? Uh, obviously I'm not adding it in here, but I think we could think it to, about a place where we can add this. I'll throw it there so I have an idea about the size of the building. I will remove this overlay and get some pathways there. So you know what? These buildings around this area, they would be quite nice. And now it's easy to connect this as well. So we just go back here, make a nice curve and connect over there. Now, what's interesting is that we probably need the same around here. I want to have like a few of those uh, dorms around the riverbank. You won't hear this, but I can hear every single building upgrading and you probably can see that this area already look different. And yeah, that's quite nice. So yeah, another building upgrading there, buildings upgrading there, so quite good. Now, what else do we need? We can have Elizabeth International College. Yeah, that's not quite the name that I want. Um, we can have the art study hall. So this one, it's quite a large building. Maybe we should go... I just don't like these over here, but that might work for me. I have an idea about that. Let's see. Let's see. I'm happy with that. And what I'll do, I'll probably just do something like this and that'll be enough to connect that building and let's add some water in here yay how are we doing with this we already have all the students that we need for another level we just need more campus att attractiveness and some academic workers so let's increase that that'll be easy to get some more attractiveness we do have this drama club where can we add our drama club i'm thinking about up there what do we have here 
I don't know if that'll be the best building for that area. Let's see how that looks. Nice. And then we definitely need a pathway over there. From here, we grab our little nice pathway. And we go from here. In this one, I'll do a free form here because that'll be a few curves around here that I think are quite important for us to get back to the level that we want down there. And I will want to have another connection around this area. We do have an area that we can work now. I quite like this going up there. I'll add water uh, in a second. And we also have the groundskeeping. This one we've done. I think that's just the groundskeeping that we need to do. And what I was thinking is to add this at the bottom here. But you know what? Being somewhere in the middle would make more sense for this. I think at the back here would make more sense. And we have all buildings there. Now we just need water. And here we go. We have water for everyone. And let's take a look at this. We now have the attractiveness that we need. Exactly the number that we need. We have a lot of students. A lot. And we just need academic work. And I can actually give some grant for them and spend some money on this. I think at the beginning it would be quite nice. We can have like uh, some of these policies and they'll be quite nice. But at the moment, I think I won't add anything and I'll just keep it the way it is. But we do need a name for that. I'll think about something or just leave me a comment uh, in the comment section and I'll, I'll get on it. But yeah, as you can see, there is a lot of people walking in here. But what we need is actually some public transportation. And the best way in this area to get that going is to get the ferry stop. So that's not too close to any other stops. And I'll do it right here, I, I would say, or maybe Or here, or there. Here, my only concern is the noise with the uh, for the dormitories, which I believe, you know what? That's all right. And the reason why I say that that's all right is because, well, you have ferries going through all this area, and I kind of forgot about that. But anyway, I just need to connect these now and ferry pathway. Let me pause the game before we make a mess and let's reconnect this. And now we just connect the lines in here. So from here, we connect there and on the way back, we connect there as well. Just stop there. Good. And this one, stop there. All right. That's what I want. Now, we definitely need to fix this. I think we have a problem there. And you know what? I could give them straight access to the, to the campus from here. Why not? So let's get a straight line over there and connect right here. Beautiful. So if anyone wants to go down to the pier and get a ferry, they can do so right there. Now parking. We need some parking in this area and let's work on it. And um, we probably want something that'll be good, like for a good size for that. That's what I mean. And I'll add one over here, and I'll probably add another one around this area as well. 
maybe you know what I can add a road in here We have the parking lots in there and I'm glad they are already using it. One thing that we could here could do here to help them use it even more is actually say please don't park here. And I think that's fair enough if we say look at how many people we have here already. Oh wow. <laughs> that's fantastic. Oh not here please. All right, this is working well. Uh, what I have to do here is basically just some basic adjustments in there. Not that we need that, but I think it's useful to have things like this. Uh, we don't need anything there. In here, we've already set up this. There is quite a lot of people walking, which is fantastic. I really like to see that. Look at these, there is a lot of people in here. So the ferries are full again. Nice, we might have to take a look at that. So how are we doing here on our academic year? Uh, no academic works yet, but it's fine. We're spending a lot, but it's okay. We are spending with this, so which is fine. If you look at the money here, we should take a look at the education and yeah, we are spending quite a lot of money with education, but that's fine. This will help us uh, with in other areas. As you can see, we don't have anyone asking for highly educated people again. And if we look at this overlay, this is starting to look much, much better. And we still have, uh, we still need a lot more. So this is where we are with capacity and we should be around here. But it's all right. How are we doing with the dorms? They are quite full. We could even expand these a little bit if we want to. But I think for now, these would be all that I that I have. I think I'm uh, really happy with how this is turning out. There is a lot of work for us to do here at the university, but look at that. We have people attending the drama club in here. And they have quite a view. It's like, I envy what they're doing here. And just this pathway, if you look at it, just going down here, you can see, oh, look at that. So, so good. And you can basically see all those buildings around there or farming area or new areas or new developments over here. The ferry is coming and going and I'm quite happy. But before we go, I want to take a look at the ferries just to make sure that we, we have enough capacity because we do have quite a lot of people using it. And as you can see, this stop is quite busy, which is the university, and I'm really happy about that. And what else? This one is quite busy for the island. So yeah, we think that we need a couple more vehicles in here. And yeah, hopefully they don't keep getting in each other's way. But let's see, we have to keep an eye on this and make sure that everything is working as it should but they seem to have like a good distance between them. So yeah, I don't see any problem as of this moment. But yeah, I really hope you enjoy this episode and I really hope you enjoy our new university. And uh, obviously don't forget to like the video if you enjoy it. Don't forget to subscribe as well so you can see what happens next and what we do here at our university. And also consider watching the video on your screen at the moment. This might be something that you like. Thanks again, and I'll see you in the next one. 
拜。